What is going on, Fields and Channel Colts? I'm Anka Dash, and I'm back, and I actually have a little bit of a story. Um, I quit out to see if I could, um, fix the, uh, the always running glitch, as you can see I have now. But, um, I came, I opened up the menu, and a lot of these things aren't complete. Okay, that one is. But, like, if you look at, uh, options, it just says, sorry, this part of the UI is incomplete. Escape, close this window. So, um, I tried to exit, and I'll click it, and it says, are you sure? Quit the title, exit game, and I was like, okay, I'll quit the title, maybe it's a save and exit thing. And, um, it didn't save, I had to start all over. Um, I ran through and took care of the, I accepted Derpy's quest, and I got Barry Punch's quest up to where it is now. But I, I didn't go through and talk to everybody about everything, uh, yet, so some of that stuff may be inconsistent. Some stuff I accidentally asked, because I was, like, clicking constantly trying to get through the, uh, the, um... Uh, uh, let me dance around for a little bit. Um, I was trying to get through the uh, dialogues faster since I'd already read them. I didn't need to read them again, but I accidentally like asked them because like next is in the same spot as their first question. So um, so uh, sometimes I asked them things I didn't necessarily want to, but it's okay now. Um, anyways, let's continue. Apparently there's like a Celestia statue you have to hit in order to save, that's the thing. Alright, here's the Spot Twins. I thought I saw them last time. Good evening, Miss Sparkle. You're out late. You two are up late. What's going on? We're not out late. We are out early. It is you who is out late. Sounds like, uh, Gandalf. Doesn't change the fact that you're out awfully er awful early, does it? Uh, I see. You are wise in the ways of argument, are you not? Uh, next. What? Uh, I can't click on next. Enough of your tricks. I will talk if you release this grip on me. What? I'm, I have a grip on her? I am so lost. My sisters and I have been busily renovating the spa. That is all, I swear. You could have just said that. More tricks! <laughs> I shall not succumb! Shoo! Oh, hello. I just knew her as one of the spa twins. But she's pretty darn, uh, crazy? Hilarious? I don't know. Hello. What's up with your sister? She's your sister, right? Why is she acting so weird? It's an awfully rude question to ask when she's, like, right there. Uh, next. Hey, next. I see nothing weird about how she acted. She seems to think I'm some sort of trickster. Oh, that. That is not weird. She's always like that. Oh, uh, we just had a coffee, you see? She gets that caffeine, she gets all antsy. I see. We've been working too hard, but it will all be worth it soon. Our reopening is tomorrow. Please stop by! She seems so enthusiastic in her text, but then her face is like, ugh. Her name is Lotus Lotus? Not just Lotus? Oh, sure, I'll do that. Lotus. Okay, I changed back. Oh, no, I didn't want to ask that again. Oh, it's Lotus, Twilight Lotus, Twilight Lotus, Lotus Lotus. Alright. And we'll say goodbye. I didn't see, I was doing the exact same thing that I did in the quest stuff. Okay, so you can go over here. Um... Colgate! Hi, oh, Sparkle. I I would have words with you. Okay. Really? What about your little dragon friend? What's his name? Spike. His name is Spike. Why does everybody have trouble remembering that? I don't have trouble remembering that. Uh, Spike's pretty darn awesome. Whatever. I checked my records and you and you never once scheduled him for a checkup. Uh-oh. That may be because he's a dragon. I don't think he needs normal dental work done. Think. But don't know? You're putting his oral health at risk with your petty stalling. Oh, I get it. Something something fishy is going on here. Go on the offensive, or try to reason with her, or agree with her. Oh, something that's like actually decision making. Um. Uh, Alright guys, I am back. Um, sorry, my mom called and it ended the recording on my phone. So, um, yeah, actually, I should probably wait for the voicemail too. Oh well. Anyway, I went on, I tried to reason with her. And, no, I don't want to listen to the voicemail. Um, and I say, I think he'd love to go, but he's, but he'd have to make an appointment on his own. He's not a baby, you know. 
next. He isn't, but I heard he, he's a hatchlade or something like that. And just who did you hear that from? The owl that always follows you around? Oh, Owlicious is in this. I can never remember his name, but he never shuts up about you two. Owlicious? He can talk? Ooh, ooh. Just make sure he comes to see me, okay? I'm not doing my job if he gets a cavity. Alright, alright. Terrific. Now, what are you doing wandering around at this hour? Just going to do some science off in the forest? For science! Oh, you're going the wrong way. The bridge is northwest of here. Right, of course it is. Wait, wait, Colgate, I want to still talk to you. Hmm, can I ask you about... Uh, if it's not something about teeth and animal nerve endings or anesthetic, then no, you can't. Is there something else? Uh, sure, I'll ask about teeth and animal and, uh, anesthetic. So, you need to floss more. Next question. But I don't floss enough? You don't. I know it's because no plenty flosses enough. Brushing is all well and good, but flossing really deals the, kill the killing blow to bacteria. Is there something else? Uh, enamel. Oh, uh, you know, I wrote my dissertation on enamel, enamel physiology. What about it? I know nothing about it. Really? You poor deprived pony, you. Well, enamel is around 98% hydroxyl apatite, which is calcium phosphate hydroxide mineral. I didn't know minerals form in a pony's body. Tooth enamel is the only case I know of. All other structures are bio biologically modified. That's a bit of science trivia for later. Anyway, appetite has three formulaic variations. Hydroxyl appetite, fluor appetite, and strontium appetite. I hope she doesn't go on about this forever. Not the radio the radiogenic version of strontium, I hope. Oh hey, radiogenic pony, if you're watching this, sh sh shout out to you, because Twilight said radiogenic. Anyway, that's a common misconception. Strontium ac actually occurs naturally as a substitution of calcium. It's not all nuclear stuff. Anyway, while appetite is hard, it's also brittle and can be worn down by acid. When you eat a lot of sugar, the bacteria in your mouth produce acid and can wear down the enamel. That's why you need to brush and floss to get the acid off. Oh, I need to study up on dentistry. I'll give you some literature when you bring your little friend over for a checkup. Is there something else? Anesthetic. I thought you'd tell me something about anesthetic. I'm by no means the expert on all the neurochemistry, but I can tell you how I do it. I take a big needle and inject lidocaine into, the, into your nearest molar. A needle in my mouth? Tell me about it, Twilight. It's only for big surgery, and it numbs the pain really quickly. You don't feel a thing. That's not helping at all. Well, let him brush and floss more often. Maybe I won't need to shove a needle in your mouth, yeah? Was there something else? Goodbye. I didn't brush my teeth last night. I feel bad. This is Colgate's house. The bottom floor is also a dental clinic. Okay, why is she standing over there? Uh... Nothing over here. Anything here? No. Nope. Not a huge fan of these giant, empty patches of space. And invisible walls. So that will take me back home. Not home, but... Okay, let's go back here. Oh! Oh! It's Derpy! And Dr. Hooves! And Alicious! What are they all doing over here? Wait, is this the Celestia statue? It is! Okay! Statue of Prince Celestia, looking, looking triumphant. It exhibits a soft glow. Okay, we, we won't save for a game yet. Uh, we'll leave. Oh, it's not it's not quite a quite a ball, not literally, but it's time it's not quite a ball, not literally, but it's like a ball. I'm with you so far. I don't know, but say that quite often yet. I don't know, you say that quite often, yet I'm never sure if you mean it. I always mean it. Even when I don't follow you, I'm still with you. Pardon the interruption, but what are you two talking about? We're talking about Hoofball! Greatest sport in the great country, isn't it? Yes, ma'am. I never miss a shout out. Oh, his name's Time Turner. Really? You couldn't have gone with Dr. Hooves? Okay, Miss Hooves. X and A on I'm Trey, Avil Trey. Uh ha. -huh. Oh, that's Big Latin, right? So I'm not supposed to talk about. Quite. Hey, how they always throw themselves down to drop penalties, don't you? Prima donnas, all of them. Just back away, Twilight. What does Derpy have to say? I haven't found her muffins yet. Yep. Yeah. Hey, you're pretty quick. Uh, who's your friend? We'll ask about, er, about Dr. Who's. So who's your friend here? Perhaps you can introduce me. Sure, this here is Alicious. Ooh! 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 
Who? 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 Stop! I already know who he is. I meant the other guy. Who? <laughs> ah, forget it. Uh, hey, you're pretty quick. You must be pretty quick to get over here before me. How do you mean? I came straight over here from the library and I didn't see you pass me. I'm not trying to be offensive, but Rainbow says you're not such a good flyer. Oh, I'm an okay flyer, just not at night. It's not out, Derby. Duh, I can see that. And why would it matter if, if you came from the library? Because I saw you over there. Over where? At the library! Hey, you're right, I should be at the library, shouldn't I? I lost that box of muffins today. Oops, I mean, did you give me my muffins back yet? Uh, no. Uh, great, I think. I'm still new at this. Just a typical conversation with therapy. Alright, goodbye. Can we talk to Owlicious, or just the Celestia statue? Okay, we'll... We'll save... Our game. And... Okay, there's the bridge to Everfree Northwest. I would have liked to go to Everfree Northwest. There's like a house over here. You know, it's just... These environments are kind of huge. Wait, I, I have the question. So... This house isn't Colgate, so why is she still... Oh, I just walked through Colgate. Hey! There's, uh, there's no clipping on the, uh, on the ponies, it looks like. Well, we'll save our game. What the hell? And... Sure, to which slot? Slot 1. Game saved. Alright. Uh, let's leave. We don't have too much longer in this episode. Oh, hey, is that you, Twilight? Uh, what in tarnation are you doing out here this late at night? Hi, Applejack. I heard that a meteorite may have fallen in the forest, so I'm going to be the first one there to see it. I'll bet I can fill a year's worth of letters to Princess Celestia with any everything I can learn about it. Uh-huh. Wouldn't it be better to wait until morning? Uh, Spike said the same thing. Eh, of course not. Some Something could contaminate the site if I let it sit. By the way, Applejack, what are you doing out here? Uh, the same reason why you came this way, I suppose. Oh, really? I never knew you had such a scientific streak in you. We could discover the meteor together. We could both fill yours with a princess of letters to the princess. We could... I've got enough rocks to look at around the farm, so I was just making sure there was nothing ca coming to threaten my orchard. But, uh, are you sure you don't want to discover the meteorite with me? Try around the Everfree Forest at night, I think I'll pass. Oh well, I couldn't convince Spike to go along either. Twilight, you're not thinking of going in there by your homes, lonesome, are you? Meteor? Meteor! This may be my only chance to study a new one. Oh, for Celestia's. Tell you what, Ty, you're the last pony I'd expect to win an argument with, so I'll go with you. But only if you promise we'll only stay as long as we have to. Okay. Really? I promise. We won't have to stay very long, just long enough to investigate it and get some samples. I study the composition. And estimate the impact velocity by checking for stisovite. I don't know what that is. And, alright, alright. Save the yapping for when we get there. The sooner we find this hunk of rock, the sooner we can come back to the farm. Applejack has joined the party. Yay! Hey, Applejack. Right behind you, Twilight. Alright, the Everfree Forest. Okay, I don't really want to go to the Everfree Forest yet. I'm going to save the game. Whoa! Uh, Applejack disappeared. Um... The statue of Princess Celestia, let me try on Uh, restore party. The statue fades momentarily. You feel much better. Um... Where's Applejack? Um... Well, I guess we'll save our game to slot two. Um... So, we'll try to load that. And then, if that doesn't work, we can load back at slot one, slot one to get Applejack back. Game saved. Okay. So, we'll leave. And, uh, I guess until next time, I make a dash. And I'm out.